we're going to look at how to do the sight reading cards for level C. Now that we're reading the notes on the staff with um, My Dog Fritz and Creepy Basement and other songs, we can start doing sight reading cards with notes on the staff as well. Um, if you have cards that came from my studio, you're going to want to place the card in your sheet protector that should be in your binder and write on it with a dry erase marker. Here's the sheet protector, this plastic thing. Stick your card in there and write on it with a dry erase marker. If you have your own copy or a photocopy, you can write directly on it with a pencil or a pen or a crayon or whatever. Um, but don't write on the cards that I sent home from the studio. So we're going to mark just like we do our songs when we play them in the book. First thing you want to do is mark your starting note. Treble clef, starting note is our guide note, second line here, G, so I'm going to write G up there. And then we want to look through the song and or look through the um, exercise and notice if there's any sames. So let's see whether the intervals go up or down or same. G, down, 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 same, same, same. See all those sames in a row? I'm going to mark all those. Let's try it again. G, down, 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 same, 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 up, 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 same, same. So I'm going to mark these ones as well. Now you can play it. So I'm going to set five on G. I always like to pretend, I don't know why they didn't write a repeat sign. Let's make it into a repeat. So you play it twice, sometimes even three times if you need to. Ready? Here we go. G, down, 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 same, 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 up, 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 same, same. Repeat. G, down, 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 same, 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 up, 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 same, same. And if you need to, you can play it a third time if it still needs a little bit of extra work. So let's go on to the left hand one. I'm going to switch to blue, B for bass clef. Here's my bass clef. What's my guide note in the bass clef in the left hand? It's C, remember? So I'm going to write that below it. Now let's see if there's any sames in this one. C, same. There's one. Let's mark it. Then which way do we go here? Down, same. So let's mark that one. Down, same, same, same. Lots of sames there, so let's mark them. Okay, I think we're ready. Oh, don't forget, you want to make it a repeat sign. Always do it twice, three times if you need to. So let's put our thumb down here on our base C. Here we go, ready? C, same, down, same. Now the rhythm patterns, this is kind of a funny rhythm pattern. Do you notice how they're all the same? Tati Tati or Zachariah? I'm going to say Zachariah because that helps me keep track of the groups. So I'm going to say Zachariah, 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 Zachariah. That's kind of a goofy one. Let's look at a different rhythm pattern just to get a better idea. So in this rhythm pattern, you can still recognize those um, animal patterns that we've learned. This one you can see Zachariah Zebra. Here you see Roar. Now this isn't exactly an anim animal pattern, is it? I don't really recognize that one. So I'm just going to say Ta Ta Zachariah. And then I'm going to say Ta Ta Ta. So let's say this one using the animal patterns as much as we can. So we would tap it and you can clap it if you want. I just can't clap because I'm holding the video. So ready? Here we go. Zachariah zebra. Roar. Two, three, four. 
ta ta Zachariah cha tu ta ta I guess you could say zebra Zachariah if you wanted because that one's flip-flopped now another way you can do it is just to say the names of the notes as they come along so we'd say like this ta ti ta ti ta 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 two three four ta 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 ti ta ti ta two ta ta so each day you want to pick one card to do do the right hand pattern the left hand pattern and then the rhythm pattern once you've done it you can move it to the back of the pile and then you'll be ready to move on to the next card the next day.